Hello lovely people, I just came back home and if you saw my previous video, I've just recently installed a two-way in the OEM location. So Midway is in the doors and tweets are in the same panel running on the small amplifier. And uh, since I have like very, very fresh impressions because I was uh, listening to music while I was driving and with the current setup, I have this amplifier on uh, Bluetooth and I have the other system wired via usb and i can switch between them like literally instantly and it's very easy to compare the two systems how they sound and i'm not going not, not going to compare the tonality because it's not important what is important is the imaging because it's like when you flip it between those two it's absolutely, absolutely, totally different. And the difference is that if I listen to, let's say the DP in the doors, I listen to it, I have like, I have the center image, everything is fine. And when I switch to the main system with these SB Acoustics, Dash and the uh, Kicks, when I switch it, it's like, if you imagine like a ball, it kind of implodes into one, almost one dot. So the image becomes very, very precise, but it's not like, it's not mono because you can still hear the instruments wherever they are. But like, if you have a center image, like a singer in the center with the main system, it sounds like it's coming literally from that dot, like from one single dot. But on the DP, on the two way in the OEM locations, you have like, like a ball, like a location. So the image is kind of bigger and much wider. And the height is slightly different as well. With the main system, it's like, I want to say like this, this high, close to like just above the dash. But with the DP, with the two-way, it's like, it looks like it's higher but it's not as precise. And I was running through the ammo positioning tracks, like left, right, center, and everything. What I noticed is my main system, I mean, it images, for me personally, it images very, very good, very nice. But the two-way, you have the center, which is like bigger. Then you have the right side, hard right side. The sound is coming. It looks like it's coming from this tweeter. When in reality, this one is playing, but it looks like it's this one. And exactly the same on the hard left. The tweeter is there, but it sounds like it's coming from there. And uh, the center is kind of center. The left center is there. The right center is not there, but it's more like here. And... Since am I, since this is my like first impressions, I have a theory about why this is. Because the difference is that on my main system, I have mid-range firing. Sorry for the focus because it's start trying to focus to my hand. The main system, uh, the mid mid-range is firing up the glass, and the tweeter is right on axis towards you. So it's kind of point source, whereas this tweeter. And this one, it's not aimed towards me. These tweeters are aimed like opposite to each other. I try to aim them slightly towards me, but I guess this one, I guess it's aiming like maybe like here towards the headrest or maybe to the pillar. And that one is aiming probably to this glass or something like that. And my theory is that these tweeters when they're firing, they have reflections coming off the glass. So if you have one source there, you have a reflection from the glass. And when you sum them, it sounds like it's coming from there. And exactly the same with this one. You have the main source sound that's coming towards you. There's a reflection from the glass and it kind of sums. It looks like it's coming from the middle. And my theory is that when you include those reflections from the main glass, the center becomes bigger, I want to say. The center is there, it's just, it's it's much bigger. It's, 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 it looks like it's... The thing is, it's not as wide, like the left and right, since they start there, they should be there, left and right. 
but it sounds there. So the stage is not as wide, but it's much more diffused. I want to use the word and the height difference as well, because it's it's not diffused like sideways It's diffused up and down as well. And I think this has to do with the mid base and the doors, because this mid base to reach the tweeter, it plays very high all the way up to like 3K. And uh, you have like big massive distance between the mid range and the tweeter. Whereas in this system, the distance is literally they're on the same plane. Whereas this is very different height. And this, I guess, gives you the height difference because you have, uh, if you play like, I would imagine like 3K something tone, you have the same tone coming from the mid bass, which uh, sums like, at this height because you have both of them there and then you have tweeters at the same frequency 3k they sum up there plus all the reflections and everything and then you have like the same note coming from two different places and i guess brain doesn't know what to do with it and it kind of diffuses it up and down so I don't know, this is just my theory that reflections, because it sounds like it's out of phase, I want to say, but not completely. It's just, it's very different sound through this two-way system. And um, I thought I might try to flip the polarity and everything, but I did impulse response. So I know that the phase and everything is like the the polarity is correct, they sum nice, everything is fine, so it has to do with the reflections. And my take from this, comparing like a three-way with a two-way, uh, it's not a fair comparison, because these are again aimed towards you, whereas this is like, this tweet is totally off axis, like probably like 60 degrees. And that diffused center, I would imagine is caused by reflections from the glass so i guess it has a similar effect when you have like uh speakers in the pillars and the aim towards towards the side and now when i think about it uh, if you remember the video that i did about the nissan kashkai when it came with audison gear and audison virtuoso dsp i couldn't when i tuned the system i had something similar that something is not right and there's not like very very precise center and in that install everything was aimed like towards the side and i thought that was reflections as well so i think it has to do a lot with the reflections now what i want to do now is make a comparison between uh same two way is just instead of having the tweeter firing that way aim the tweeter literally on axis so Today, tomorrow, I don't have any time. Sunday, Sam, Emma, and the week after, probably Monday or Tuesday, what I'm going to do, I'm going to remove the tweeter from here and I'm going to tilt it and aim it, maybe like hot glue it or whatever, just temporary, uh, to this to have it right on axis and just to see if that center image improves, if it's going to shrink or is going to stay the same because I imagine it has to do with the reflections. Yeah, it's just I want to take it out of my chest because I had like very, very fresh uh, impressions because I was listening to this car for literally uh, 45 minutes while I was driving and just flipping back and forth. Yeah, so these are my impressions that off axis bounces from the glass and dash and everywhere and makes your center diffused, not as precise. And if you have like speakers point source, and all up high, you're going to have very, very precise center image. Yeah, so these are my impressions. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I will see you in the next one.